Hi. I am uh, just posting this brief little message here. Uh, very, very interesting that, you know, a few months ago, I posted a message dealing with the lies, the Mormon lies of uh, all these commercials we've been seeing about, hi, you know, I'm, I'm normal and I'm happy and I'm a Mormon. And uh, I finally realized, and somebody in our church said this, and it was really, uh, really made sense. Those were all political commercials, because now as this is uh, June fifteenth uh, of two thousand and eleven, and we're preparing for a wonderful presidential election. I'm sure it's just going to be really great. Uh, all the mudslinging ads that we're going to have to put up with for the next year and a half, but. They were all political commercials. Uh, one of the leading candidates is Mitt Romney, who is a Mormon, the ex-governor of Massachusetts. And I think we've been being brainwashed to, to think, hey, Mormons, uh, sure, they wear magic underwear, and they think that God was man on another planet, and uh, they think that Jesus is the, uh, you know, the brother of Lucifer, and they think that we all live before somewhere else and we're all going to get our own planets if we're good Mormons. I'm, yeah, I mean, yeah, they're normal. I mean, yeah, yeah, they're happy and they paint and they sing and they have kids and they do all this other stuff. And um, they, they can even be president. Let me tell you this much. I'm a uh, born-again Christian. I will never vote for a Mormon to be president. Never. I'll vote for Bugs Bunny before I vote for a Mormon, or I won't vote at all. It's not about who the president is. It's about who is Lord. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, and the knowledge of the holy is understanding. I don't care if the guy's pro. I don't care what he is. If he worships some strange pantheon of gods that the Mormons do. If he thinks he's going to have multiple wives in the next life because he's not allowed to have them now. That's what they do. They used to have, uh, you know, they used to have polygamy until they wanted to become a state. Utah wanted to become a state so they had to outlaw polygamy so they could be accepted to be a state. But the real fundamentalist Mormons uh, still practice that polygamy stuff. So if you want to vote for him, that's fine, but I'll never vote for anybody like that. Because, you know, my real citizenship is in heaven. It's not here. So I vote for Jesus. How about you? God bless you. Have a nice day.